Good evening, everyone. I am Mr. Schmidt, our school's principal, and it's an honor to be here tonight to present to you our 2024 sixth grade graduation. It's uh, going to be a fun evening. The best part of the evening is we get to listen to every sixth grader tell you where they would like to be in 20 years. So with that being said, please hold your applause until the end so that we can hear every student share where they're going to be in 20 years. So with that, I would like to share that in 20 years, I hope to be retired, <laughs> spending most of my time hunting and fishing, and hopefully have some grandchildren. So enjoy the graduation ceremony, and thank you for being here. My name is Skylar Whiting. 20 years from now, I hope to be a vet and have a family of two or three kids and drive a purple Jeep. Hi, my name is Max Weiser. 20 years, I hope to be an engineer, play college baseball, and have two kids. Hi, my name is Lucas Sherpush. In 20 years, I hope to be a farmer, race car driver, and have a family of four. Hi, my name is Elaine Town, and 20 years from now, I hope to be a new biologist with two dogs and happily single. <laughs> Hi, my name is Seth Grimes, and so I'm 20 years from now, I'm a beautiful couple. Hi, my name is Sawyer Knack, and 20 years, I hope to be a DNR officer. Twenty years from now, I hope to own my own lawn care business. Hi, my name is Brianna Langer. Twenty years from now, I hope to be a mom and work in that hilltop garden. Hi, my name is Cameron Cruzel. Twenty years from now, I hope to be in the NFL and be a great dad like my own. In Colstrom, 20 years from now, I hope to be in the NFL or MLB. Hi, my name is Shimmer Jacobs, and in 20 years from now, I hope to be a math teacher and have kids. Hi, my name is Anna Green, 20 years from now, I hope to own a dog business. Hi, my name is Summer Kid, and 20 years from now, I hope to be married, a mom, a student, four kids, and a farmer. Hi, my name is Thomas Glenetsky. 20 years from now, I hope to be an NFL football player. Hi, my name is Brian Lanier. 20 years from now, I hope to be a tattoo artist or a professional musician. Hi, my name is Corey Dennis. 20 years from now, I hope to be a lawyer and drive a blue Ford truck. <laughs> My name is Lucy Boyer. 20 years from now, I hope to own a restaurant or business. Hi, my name is Julia Anderson. 20 years from now, I hope to be a surgeon, own an orange Tesla, and be a mother of four children. Hi, my name is Aiden Aiden Keefton, and 20 years from now, I hope to be a mountain biker. Hi, my name is Ethan Schultz, and 20 years from now, I hope to be doing heavy construction. Hi, my name is Luke Wrestling, and in 20 years from now, I'm going to be a truck driver. Hi, my name is Ryder Rodriguez, and 20 years from now, I hope to be a pro artist and a fashion designer. Hi, my name is Caitlin Manson, and 20 
years from now, I hope to be the owner of a mac and cheese shop. <laughs> Hi, my name is Abby Marcy's. 20 years from now, I hope to be a doctor or a nurse. Peyton Melvin, and 20 years from now, I want to be a DNR officer of my first team. Hi, my name is Tara Lovers. 20 years from now, I want to be a nursing counselor. Hi, my name is Camden Lang, and 20 years from now, I hope to be a DNR officer with Peyton Melvin. My name is Boston Hiddle, and 20 years from now, I hope to be a successful fisherman and hunter. Hi, my name is Danny Hathaway, and in 20 years, I hope to be a professional artist and own the legal amount of cats. <laughs> Hi, my name is Riley Gould, and 20 years from now, I hope to be a successful football player. This is Mason Denny, and in 20 years from now, I hope to play in a band. Hello, my name is Alyssa Dean, and in 20 years from now, I hope to be a business owner. Hello, my name is Liam Chisholm, and in 20 years from now, I want to be a professional football player or farmer. Hello, my name is Chase Shermock, and in 20 years, I want to be a computer scientist. Hi, my name is Andrea Camon, and I'm a lawyer. Hi, my name is Ryan Gould, and in 20 years now, I hope to be a veterinarian. Hello, my name is Brayden Stigman, and 20 years from now, I hope to be a video game developer. Hi, my name is Parker Schultz. 20 years from now, I hope to be a professional football player or a math teacher. Hi, my name is Melina Pappas. 20 years from now, I want to be a veterinarian. Hi, my name is Elio Trimba, and 20 years from now, I hope to be furthering the use of artificial intelligence in small businesses. Hello, my name is Lucas Olga. In 20 years, I hope to be in the NFL with two Super Bowl wins and after a teacher. Hi, my name is Holden Hellas. In 20 years from now, I hope to be a bee farmer or a tax journalist. Hi, my name is Andy Mertz, and in 20 years from now, I hope to be a successful welder. Hi, my name is Ari Lund, and in 20 years from now, I hope to be a zookeeper and take care of exotic animals. Hi, my name is Claire Corbin, and in 20 years from now, I hope to be a professional horse driver. Hi, my name is Ian Gulzer, and 20 years from now, I hope to be a reader, computer programmer. Hi, my name is Lainey Club, and 20 years from now, I hope to be a WME player and an ESPN Sports Analyst. Hi, my name is Lily Johnson, 20 years from now, I hope to be a semi truck driver. Hello, my name is Thomas Finnegan, and in 20 years from now, I hope to run a successful business. Hi, my name is Ben Ferris. 20 years from now, I hope to be an interior designer or archaeologist. Hi, my name is Will Duchesne, and 20 years from now, I want to be a professional football player. 
Hi, my name is Ty Jordan. 20 years from now, I want to be a police officer or a professional football player. Hi, my name is Jack Danny. In 20 years, I have to work with animals. My name is Jadalyn Brayer. In 20 years from now, I hope to be a doctor or a nurse. Hi, my name is Chloe Elbert. In 20 years from now, I hope to be a professional volleyball player or cosmetologist. of you and your classmates. For example, you might always remember who shared the spiciest snacks at morning break, was an exceptional bingo caller at classroom parties, collected all the Harry Potter wizard ones, knows women's NCAA statistics better than any adult. <laughs> you might remember who perfected the art of sharpening a pencil so that it looks like a tiny drill bit. <laughs> or who made creative card games from scratch, or who won the big drawing contest, or who can devise a unique alphabet code for secret messages. These are just some of the memories that I have of all of you that I bet will also <coughs> stick with you for a long time. You have many years to figure out what you're truly passionate about, but whenever you find it, whatever it is, let it drive you to do incredible things. As Oprah Winfrey has said, passion is energy. Feel the power that comes from focusing on what excites you. This group is creative, intelligent, and funny. I wish you all the very best as you continue to discover the passions that will drive you to do amazing things. I will now, ca now call the students in my homeroom to receive their certificates, and again, we ask that you hold your applause until the end. <laughs> Chloe Albert. <laughs> Jalen Bruder. <laughs> Jack Daney. Ty Drum. Will Duchesne. Bryn Ferris. Thomas Finnegan. Miley Holden. Lillian Johnson. Lainey Calpine, Kamara Cordum, Aiden Culzer, Aria Lund, 
Landon Menson, Mason Molitor, Holden Niehaus, Lucas Ogle, Eleanor Otrimba, Melina Papish, Parker Schultz, Braden Stigman, Emma Vandekieft, Skills. I have been teaching sixth grade for many years. Every class is different, every class has their own dynamic with how they get along, and every class has their own strengths and weaknesses. You might think I'm going to talk about the strengths of these students, but tonight I'm going to focus on one of their weaknesses. In front of you is a group of kids that talk. <laughs> they have a lot to say to each other, and they have a lot to say to everyone in every situation. I recently came across a quote that said, weaknesses are just strengths in the wrong environment. This struck me because this is exactly the situation these students find themselves in. School is a place that doesn't always allow a lot of free time to talk, so their tendency to have conversations can be frowned upon. This certainly can be a weakness for them, especially when we are trying to teach a concept during class time, but their ability to talk can also be a big strength in many situations. The students in front of you are able to have excellent discussions in class. These students will talk to anyone and make everyone feel welcome with their openness and kindness. These students will stick up for each other and are there to help each other out in tough situations. These students love being around each other and their teachers most of the time. <laughs> they have an excitement for life and learning and they want everyone to know it. Sixth graders, I hope your excitement to talk to each other and the people that cross your paths never changes. I hope that you enjoy being around each other and cherish your time together over the next six years because it will go fast. So remember that your talkative nature is a major strength in the right environment and in the right situation. But also remember this quote, be a good listener. Your ears will never get you in trouble. <laughs> All right, I'm going to present the certificates to my class. Andrea Carmona. Chase Sherma. Liam Chisholm. Alyssa Dean. Mason Denny. Ruth Flatton. Elizabeth Floor. Riley Gould, Danny Hathaway, Boston Hiddle, Camden Lane, T. 
Taylor Lovers. Peyton Malvin. Abigail Marcy's. Caitlin Benson. RJ Leonid Rivera. Ryder Rodriguez. Luke Wrestling. Easton Schultz. Isabella Sherman. Avery Vandeke. Others may see in you, it's actually an ability to be unique and different. As you move forward, may you be like Avon and always see the sunny side to every obstacle. Next, we read Words on Fire. We learned about Audra and her belief to stand up for what is right, even if you are standing alone. May you always have the courage to do the right things and stand up for your beliefs, even if you're standing alone. In January, we read, we read A Long Walk to Water a novel based on the true story of Selma, who was one of the lost boys in Sudan. We learned of his astounding perseverance in the face of adversities, to never give up, and to keep going. When hard challenges face you, may you persevere and never give up. In Frame, we saw Florian's quest for knowledge to look for the little details in the big pictures. May you have a quest for knowledge in all you do and all you learn in the years to come. And we ended the year with Restart, a story of a boy named Chase who gets to restart his life. Through any obstacles of your past or your future, you always have the opportunity to start over. Become the best version of yourself and who you truly want to be. Each of you are unique and amazing. May you never be afraid to show how special you are. Congratulations, sixth graders. I'd now like to present the certificates for my homeroom. Julia Anderson, Lucy Boyer, Piper Khan, Cora Dempsey. Peyton Field, Thomas Lunetsky, Summer Goodwin, Gemma Jacobson, Emma Green, <coughs> Ian Kolstrom, Mercy Kendall was unable to join us tonight, Cameron Cruzel, Brielle Langner, Riley Marthaler, Ben Munsterman, Sh 
Sore your neck. Zacharias and Seda. Elena Tenna. Lucas Trampush. Max Weiser. Scarlett Whiting.